Pixel Pad Smart Break Game Jam is starting on March 11th. If you're not so sure about how you're going to create a game based on a theme, don't worry. I'm here to show you how easy it is to create a game in Pixel Pad. To create a game doesn't necessarily mean that you have to write many lines of code. You can create a totally different game just by changing some sprites. First, find a game you like in Pixel Pad. To see this game's code, add question mark edit equals 1 to the URL. In this page, you can see all the code, sprites, and sounds used to create this game. Now, leave this tab open and open Pixel Pad again in another tab. Then, go to My Apps and create a new app. All you need to do now is to copy all classes and rooms from that game to yours. As you cannot really copy a project's sprites and sounds, you will have to add your own assets to the game. You can use Pixelpad's asset library or other free websites to get the sprites and sounds you want. To know which websites to use, check the research channel in Discord. Also, remember that when you upload the assets you're going to need, you will have to use the same name they have in the original project. If the extension is different, for example .jpg instead of .png, you will have to find where in the code that asset name is being used and change it. For sprites, you should check first the class who should be using that sprite. If I want to change my Flappy's sprite, for example, I would go inside my bird class. And there you can see the sprite name being used. For sounds, it's a bit more complicated since you have to find which class or room is playing that sound. After adding your own assets, you have now created your own version of the game. You could even go further and change some other in-game details like the spacing between the pipes. In my Flappy game, you can change that in the load room. I would also want to change how many points I will earn each time I score. Who would be deciding that? The pipe class, maybe? Hmm, there's nothing about the score here. Maybe this score collider? Oh, here it is. If this collides with the bird, it increases my game scoring 1. I can also change that in my game. There. Now it gives me 3 points when I score. That's how easy it is to create your own games in Pixelpad. If you want to know more about coding, check our tutorials and tidbits in our YouTube channel. Also, join our Discord to get in touch with our community and get ready for the gem. Alright, I'll see you later, bye!